YouTube fam, your boy Bruce back with another video. I'm gonna get straight to the point on this one. Uh, I have a tuned car and a lot of people have tuned cars and there's this big debate on which spark plugs work the best. So I'm just gonna give you my experience. As you can see, I bought every spark plug known to man to try to find how my car can run the best. Um, I, I gap them. I, I, I literally have um, bought like 10 different sets of um, spark plugs, but these are the, the most common spark plugs. Okay, you got your NGK. These are the factory ones, the um, NGK double platinums, the um, seven um, heat rate range. Then you have your Iridium, which is um, technically one step up. They say if you go Iridium, you have a bigger spark on your car. It lasts a lot longer on your car, you know, versus the traditional one that comes um, comes with your car. Then you have the Bosch Double Platinum, which is alternative to this one right over here. And then you have your um, NGK um, eights. And so when it's an eight, the higher the number, the colder the spark plug. So if you're running a really heavy tune, it's really good to have a higher, um, you know, a colder spark plugs um, for pre-detonation. And that just basically means it's so hot in the combustion chamber that you'll get some firing before the pistons and the spark plugs does its job. So out of all of these spark plugs, I'm going to start with the ones that work the best for me. Now, I have, I'm KO4 tuned. I have meth, um, water meth. Um, injection on it. I have a turbo muffler delete. I got every tune known to man. Also, um, a lot of people say that you should gap them a certain way, like even APR. Look, man, I'm not, I'm just chilling about my experience. They say to gap your spark plugs at um, um, 0.24. I got mine at 0.24 and I lost a whole bunch of torque and power. So uh, it, 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 they, they generally come gapped around 29 or 30. So I gapped them at 28 and that's my, um, all of the different plugs. And that was my sweet, happy medium because um, the bigger the gap in the spark plug, the more fire that you get. The reason they want you to gap them small is because you got so much boost coming in your spark, um, in, into your, your spark that it can blow it out. So that's when you should probably upgrade your coils to give it a more of a bigger voltage because the way the coals work, it basically gives a, a big voltage to the end of the spark plug. And that will ultimately give you your bigger spark. So, you know, it's kind of like you do lose a little bit of torque when you gap them small. Um, I don't care what anyone says, as you can see, I bought every spark plug known to man. So getting to the question, this spark plug worked the best. The factory double platinum spark plug worked the best for me. The iridiums right here, I wasn't getting as much torque. I don't know what it is about it. I would assumed it would be better because they say rhythm is better and it's for performance. But I didn't get is I lost torque. I lo I felt like I lost power. My 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 throttle response wasn't there. Bosch double platinum plugs actually almost were identical to these. Um but one issue I had back when I had stage one Revo tune is my Bosch plugs, the ends of them would get get hot too fast. And one of them almost broke. Um, I don't know if it can handle the heat range. So I just kind of stuck with the NGK um, R and that's when I had a Revo tune, really aggressive tune. And these Iridiums, um, the colder plugs, it just didn't work for me. My car, it's like my car had a different vibe and a different feel. I would say if you're not tuned and you just want some good long plugs, go ahead and get these because a lot of times, a lot of the newer cars come with these plugs because some cars you have to literally take off intake manifolds and different variables to get to, you know, the spark plug. So they made these spark plugs for those people because you can literally go 100,000 miles, uh, 200,000 miles without changing them. So... That's why they made Iridium because you really don't have to exchange them that much. They used to have the old copper plugs, but they they were out too fast. That's why they went to platinum, double platinum, and, and there we are. So, yeah, um, this application worked the best for me. Um, I have a, you guys can see it. I got a super modded car. I mean, you guys know my videos. 
and um, just work the best. Now, some other plugs may work better for other people. I'm not here to debate that. I'm just basically saying my experience on all of the different plugs that I bought, these gave me the most power, the most torque from a numbers perspective and from a feel and a, a feel and a performance perspective. Peace out. Hope this helped you guys. Thank you. I'm going to keep the videos coming.